Hello, hello. Welcome to another episode. When we last left off, man, yes, last episode was such a struggle. And looking over the video again, uh, obviously I made a couple mistakes that got a lot of rooster get me, but I think I can take solace in the fact that it was just a very difficult run. It was very, very hard. The decisions did not line themselves up easily like sometimes they do. So I can feel a little bit better, and hopefully I can do better this time, you know. Um, but it's good to be challenged, so last, that last episode I think was painful at the time, but, you know, good for growth. Alright, don't mind my cat, he's, uh, or she's scratching. So I would really like to, to fire on right and hit that lizard. So I think I'm going to do that, and hopefully cool stuff will happen. Yeah, it counts. Sure. Okay, so I think I should walk forward maybe and collect this key. I can do this. This is actually pretty good too. The only issue is I'm, I'm definitely worried about... Uh, I think actually, yeah, I think I'm going to fire this like that. Let's see what happens. Interesting. All right. So obviously there's an issue here where I don't want to get hit by all this stuff. So I think it's actually good to just take the damage rather than have to deal with the uh, him zapping my key or warping me. I can't back up because I think I'll just get warped to the next zone. Um, and I want to collect that book and also scout my other wands. Well, this is good. So this is a cool interaction I bet you guys didn't know about. Or maybe you did if I already showed it to you. <laughs> but I can't remember if I showed it to you or not. Um, if you um, are locked in place like this with that goo, then you can auto-attack ghosts and they don't uh, die. Or and they don't run away, rather. And, and they die. Which is great. Okay, to get out of my thing, I'll start firing stuff like that. Let's go pick up this book. And then I'll probably fire this up. I think the best is to fire it up through the center and at a frog. And the frog will be on a corpse, so I'll be scouting for a lot of potential stuff here. No. Okay. Nothing. Really? Nothing? Okay. Whatever. So again, I'm stuck with the fact that that ghost may just jack my key. Um, man, this is such a, I just want to say, this is a brutal set of abilities. Just absolutely terrible. So I could do this and hope that the uh, ghost died somehow. Because I don't think I've tested for a couple things. I'm going to do this. Because I'll at least hit the ghost and poison it so that it won't... Even if it zaps my key away, it won't uh, zap um, my. It won't. It'll die before it gets to me. Okay. So let's see. I'm probably gonna have to swap out of this conundrum here. Um. Oh, you know what? No, probably not actually. What I'm gonna do? Huh, that was nice. Okay, I'm going to just fire this. Oh, wait, hold on. I don't want to... Okay, good. Um, fortunately, that ruins my play. I didn't want to... I was going to teleport like this and go uh, here, but there was a ghost right here that would have warped me to the next level, I think. So, I, I still have no idea what that does, but I just assume that's what it does, and I want to avoid it at all costs. Um, although, in this case, it wouldn't have been so bad, would it, right? Because uh, I'm locked away anyway from uh, getting that treasure, but... That's nah, alright. Let's do that. Okay, so things are going to come out of this right side. Um, and I'm trying to decide what I want to scout for. I could just fire both of them right at the frog. Um, 
But I also kind of want to scout for treasure, you know? So I think I'm actually going to fire both of these down. Okay, so now I have two things that I know don't have treasure on them. That's kind of sad, right? Um, and this one doesn't seem to have treasure either because I scouted it for two different things. I guess I can fire this one at a pillar next. See if that does anything. Overall, it's going to be a low-scoring run, it looks like. Two points out of the first two sevens. Two points, really? Uh, okay. So if I move down, then I'll get the reflect off this forgotten, which I don't think is great. Um... So I could just swap with it and gain a health. That would actually not be terrible. Hmm. Sure, yeah, let's do that. Okay. And then next... Oh crap, I just realized that... That ghost is gonna steal my stuff again. There's nothing I can do for it because I already wasted my swap. Arg! Oh no! Okay. Um, maybe I can use my refresh one in this level to uh, unlock it. That's not great, but okay. So let's fire this up and um, let's see here. I think I want to fire something. Okay, well, eventually I want to use this, right? So let's actually just take a damage and fire this up. Okay, and then I'm going to fire this down, of course, to kill a lizard. That's nice. And then, let's see here, what do I do with this guy? I can just push this guy around to hopefully... No, come on, come on. There we go. Okay, and now, probably, okay, so I can't remember what I've tested with this. Um, I know I tested this one down, and this one down, so I don't think I've tested this guy down. Uh, I've tested this up many times. So let's try that. Okay, nothing. Man, this has been a scarce round for ability, isn't it? Um, uh, okay, I think I'm just going to move to the next zone, as sad as that is. Let's test this guy one more time. I don't think this does anything, but... Oh, it does! Okay, good. Alright. Oh, I finally learned something interesting. Okay, I'm glad I... I was like an afterthought. I was like, yeah, I guess I'll test it. But that was a good... That was great. Okay. Maybe I can salvage this run a little bit. So I definitely want to hit a frog with this ability while I'm hurt. That's optimal, of course. The <laughs> ghost stole my key again. This time I'm definitely going to uh, use my refresh wand to try and... Uh, not only will I milk this for points, but I can also <clears throat> unlock that. Okay. Um, this one I also know doesn't have treasure on it now because it has uh, this take a treasure thing, so this is my only hope left, and I've tested it in a few different places. Um, okay, so now let's just fire this right, I think. Unfortunately, um, I can no longer kill this frog with my slingshot because I only have... Well, actually, no, I could still do it because I'm going to take a damage here. Okay, this will be good. Watch this. Pew! Okay, great. Two treasures. Not terrible. Okay, and then I think the only way to get around this bad boy is to... Uh... Oh, no, I can do this. 
No, I didn't fire it that way. I could have fired down. Whatever. Oh, that one also has a... Oh, cool. Very exciting. Okay. Um... So now I will cycle this. A frog will kill it. And then I'm going to bring this guy out. Okay. So first one I can just kill. And let's see here. It's an open question whether I want to try and kill two things. I don't think I do. I think that's just way too crazy at 1 HP. <laughs> so, okay, so let's... Well, maybe I can, actually. Maybe with... Hmm. Yeah, maybe I can try and kill two things. Okay. So I have to time it. So... Oh, unfortunately, I'm going to need to waste an action here. So let's fire this. Uh, I want to scout this guy for a pillar. Nice. Okay. All right. So now I'm going to just wander around, and we're going to try and get these, this frog to line up in such a way that I can hit both, I can hit two of them at once. Okay, here he comes. Let's try going that way. Uh, uh. Um, I don't really see a way out of this guy. Okay, so here's a couple things I could do. Um, yeah, maybe this isn't, maybe this wasn't the best idea. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't really see, I, I, I tried to get him to line up, but I didn't. So at this stage, I think I just have to cut my losses. I can fire this down. And then I can just uh, take this treasure, get double points. And probably I will... Oh, I can just use this right now to refresh this guy. And let's... Uh, well, I can try again. Should we try again? Um, okay, I'm trying again. <laughs> is this wise? I don't know. But it is two treasures. Oh, but I just realized I took a Okay, so, um, how am I going to get this, I guess I'll just kill him, and play, okay, so I need to somehow, ah, whatever, um, this is a little unfortunate that I... I don't know if I'm going to get value out of this last one. Eh, maybe I can. Okay. But I definitely don't want to... Oh, crap. Um, yeah, let's save a damage here. And get out of here. Okay. So now I need to finish off this last zone. I think I should be able to do it with the tools I have available, but I am definitely playing risky at entering zone 5 with 2 health. Um, but I don't know, I think it was worth it. I got a lot of stuff. I do have to play this level definitely more cons uh, more conservatively than I've played. I played that last level, because that last level I played pretty wild, right? Um, to start off, the only th good thing on this entire wand is this... Uh, Mirror, so let's kill that mirrored frog. Oh, I killed both of them. Alright. Next, um. Uh. I'm just gonna fire. Let's see here.
I can just auto attack that down, honestly. Or, even better, I think I'm going to hit it once, maybe? And then reflect? No, it's crazy, isn't it? Hmm. In retrospect, I maybe should have tried to move towards the center. Because, yeah, this is kind of ugly. Um, okay, whatever. Let's take a damage, fire this, the reflect will kill that. Then I can hit this. This guy will die from an auto attack. I'll take that. Take the key. Um, can I wander in there and not die? I think so. Uh, okay. Alright, so I can fire this down and then auto attack it down, and then fire this to the right, and grab my last treasure and get out of here. Okay, so 44 points, eh, okay. Especially given that, I mean, I had that really bad start, right, where I was just getting nothing. Um, but then finally, uh, knowledge opened up to me, and I was able to figure out some stuff. Okay, that's it for the day. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow.